uh, what's your message to those people who wants to enroll in skill stock i will say that it is the best decision they can make for me i have been in the market around for two years i didn't have any direction mm -hmm. once i have uploaded i can my i have been sending you the screenshot my mm -hmm. win rate mm -hmm. skyrocketed yeah skyrocketed i can say that <laughs> so skill stock is definitely the, the, the place to be welcome back to my youtube channel guys in this brand new video i am going to trade with my client in the live market we are going to apply all the cwrb concepts and strategies which i have explained him in the live market so let's see what will be our accuracy after applying all these things in the live market do watch this video guys and make sure to hit that like button and subscribe button if you're new here on my youtube channel i am giving you a uh, the little brief about the pressure and rejection in the normal market if See, this candle is trying to move down, right? But good pressure is coming out from the buyer side. What I will do? I will simply draw, take a level. I will draw like this. Okay, now market is respecting these points. And here also market have respected these points and also ha they have increased the volume. I can plan one trade here for the call option. Okay, now this call option is based on the momentum because here we have multiple rejections every single time. We have rejections from the buyer side right and market is keep moving in up direction so this momentum is good right and buyers also have increased the volume past in the past market they also have increased the volume and buyers have very good body right so the momentum is supporting buyers in the past market if you see there is more wicks from the buyer side right more wicks are from yes. the buyer side continuously so buyers are good in this market right and at the same time what we have to uh, uh, what we can see here is in the previous candle very good sellers tried to reach out to one of these areas it was a very wonderful seller candle, right but this candle have rejected from the buyer side at this place right so it's a very good rejection from the buyer side and now there are again possibilities that the buyers can take control over the market so that's why here buyers took control over the market let's open the chart euro gbp now here you can see that again sellers took control over the market but they decrease the volume here again, there are possibilities that this candle can close as a buyer's candle. Okay, so here you can also plan to go for the buy option at this place according to the pressure and rejection. Okay, now here you can see that the fluctuation is too high from the buyer side, right? The fluctuation is too good mm -hmm. from the buyer side. Sellers are trying, sellers are trying, but buyers are very good at this place. Okay, buyers are good. You can see that also right now, also the fluctuation is too high from the buyer side, means market wants to go in up direction right so if this candle will close as a good buyer's candle they will increase the volume i will again try to take trade for the call option okay let's see okay now here again i can see that buyers are too good in the market three okay very nice rejection was there from the seller side okay now this candle closes a buyer's candle all right euro gpp here you can see that buyers entered they have increased the volume but still in this candle the sellers entered very strongly so right now we can plan our entry point below the line for the call option and uh, also we can plan one trade for the sell option nearby these candles uh, opening price because from this particular area sellers entered very strongly so here we have two opportunities right from this area we can go for call and from this area we can go for sell these trades will be based on pressure and rejection okay now this trade was also based on pressure and rejection this trade was also ba tra uh, based on pressure and rejection along with their rejections along with their volume okay so here i place one trade again call option now you can see that the candle is trying to move in up direction but still the rejection was there from the seller side so as soon as the buyers will enter and they decrease the volume the other party will attack so the sellers will attack very soon in the market okay let's see all right so here they have decreased the volume so now here there are possibilities that the sellers will attack the market so what we can do here is let we let the candle to move in up direction so that we can plan a trade for the sell option but here we can see that this is a middle candle this is a small candle and now there is a gap between this candle's high point and this candle's nearest uh you know uh green candle so maybe there are possibilities that this candle can close nearby this candle's opening price according to our shape and size concept right so we have to yes, wait yes. for the market otherwise uh if if we get the entry point if we got the entry point nearby this places i can definitely plan a trade for the sell option but you can see that 
there are both situations are there buyers can also take control over the market sellers can also take control of the market now in this candle i can see that buyers again are trying to enter in the market but they are rejecting from the seller side so let this candle reach out to one of these areas then we can plan a trade for the sell option now here what is happening they are decreasing their volume so if this candle will close as a buyer's candle and they decrease the volume sellers will definitely attack here but again i will not try to go immediately at this place so my entry point will be at this place here will be my entry point because market will definitely try to achieve these areas you know so here you can plan one trade for the sell option because it's wonderful line you can see that and we can see that previously we have three candles entered in the market continuously and they have dropped the volume i told you that marriers will definitely try to achieve these areas right because last time they have already achieved this area but from this particular area one seller candle very good entered in the market right very good rejection from the seller side from this particular area are you getting my point yeah 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 all right so here that's why you can plan your trade here exact on the line for the sell option and now you can see that the candle is trying to move in up direction but still the rejection is coming out from the seller side in all these candles rejection was there from the seller side right here you can won the trade so this is how you have to understand the pressure and rejection this is how you have to plan your entry point and you have to plan your trades according to the market situations are you getting my point yes. yeah yeah okay so uh, now let me ask you. your turn let me ask you um, yeah let yeah. me ask you one thing yeah? Yes. Did you see the way this candle was reacting? Correct. Yes. The pressure was coming down, going up, coming down, going up. Yes. So yes. As we said, it, it is volatile. But in each candle, Correct. in each candle, see buyers were trying. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yes, buyers were trying, but sellers' presence was there. Buyers, okay. buyers were trying. Sellers' presence was there. because previously sellers entered very strongly from this particular area so also we have to consider the sellers are good in the market right okay. but buyers keep taking control over the market if they increase the volume i can definitely plan one again trade for the call option but because they drop the volume so that's why i haven't placed any trade for the call option nearby these places yeah. i try to hunt for the sellers at this place but at this place as soon as they increase the volume i plan a trade for the call option here i plan a trade for the call option getting my point yeah. Yeah. now it's your turn just analyze the market like this so uh, there is there is a level here as you have said mm -hmm. bias 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 broke the level with the mm -hmm. volume Mm -hmm. So definitely, sellers sellers will try to enter at this level. Mm -hmm. But now we wait to see this candle. Kind of what will happen? Mm -hmm. So there is pressure from the buyers. Pressure mm -hmm. from the buyers. Mm -hmm. Sellers are trying to inject here. Uh huh. And then increase the volume. Maybe from this level we can have a, a call option. Okay. From here, because we have momentum. Okay. we have with the uh, the bus have a good body and they have increased the volume here so if if they reach this area we can do a call up all right the candle is keep moving in up direction okay rejection is good from the seller side yeah 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 there is rejection mm -hmm. so if this candle reaches mm -hmm. this level mm -hmm. with low volume mm -hmm. we can try to go for a break of retracement if it okay. reaches here okay yeah but not yet not yet yeah is it good they entered in the zone and they have decreased the volume yeah and they have decreased the volume so if so they if this candle will give me good entry point also we can plan a trade for the call option right okay okay yeah, yes 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 All right, but yeah, but we can see here we have no rejection from the sellers, but and buyers did not give the did not give the, the, the buyers did not give the sellers any moment to go down, so they mm -hmm. enter and they push the market up. Mm -hmm. So we we have one sided pressure here. Mm -hmm. One 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 sided pressure here. Mm -hmm. 
So let's see how this buyers, will, uh, the sellers will push by uh, sellers. Uh, the sellers will push the buyers maybe below, or the buyers will push the, the sellers up. Mm -hmm. Let's see who is more stronger or more dominant than this. Okay. Yeah. So they entered and they lowered the volume there. Mm -hmm. So maybe from this level. Mm -hmm. We can try to do a put option around, but we have not do it. Yeah, around this level. Okay, let the candle move up. Yeah, do we have a whole number here? Oh, yes, we have. Okay. Okay. So we have fluctuation from the sellers. They are pushing, buyers are coming in. Mm -hmm. Buyers are coming in. So let's wait for this candle and see who is going. If the buyers, so sellers are coming in and, and they are increasing the volume from yeah from that level there. Yeah. Okay. Now tell me. And they have a who's they have a very good. Which volume. part is good? Sellers. Okay. So what do you think? Okay, so here can be our entry point, right? Yes, yes. Okay. All right. Now, can you please explain the situation? Like what happened here? So the situation. Okay, we can. Okay, we can say okay. that bias. Are, okay, bias have momentum going up. Mm -hmm. we, there is a zone here. Sellers zone. Mm -hmm. Se as the sellers enter mm -hmm. and they lower the volume mm -hmm. again buyers enter because we have weak sellers here definitely this momentum will try to, to push up eh? mm -hmm. now buyers enter and they lower the volume mm -hmm. again, these sellers who are present at this level they entered here and they increase the volume so we are trying to hunt for the weak mm -hmm. for the weak buyers mm -hmm. that way we we went with strong sellers here and we did a sell option. Great, great. So our entry point is on the line, right? Or beyond the line. That can be our yes, entry yes. point here for the sell option. Very yeah, nice. Yeah, yeah. Very nice. Yeah. So here yeah. we hunted for week. Mm -hmm. Sorry? Yes, you so are here we hunt properly. Yeah, okay, okay. We hunted for week buyer mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. at at sellers zoom. I can say that. Okay. Okay. All right. Uh, I think we have to stop here. Now I want you to. Uh, I want to upload uh, this footage on my YouTube channel. If you allow me, if you give me permission to upload, then I will definitely try to upload this video on YouTube, so that other will see how uh, the the session goes on, the, how the how we move to the session. So definitely, definitely. Sorry? I am saying you can upload the video. Okay. All right. Yeah. Uh, yes, I will upload this video. So now, uh, what's your message to those people who wants to enroll in skill stock? I will say that it is the best decision they can make. For me, I have been in the market around for two years. I didn't have any direction. Mm -hmm. Once I have uploaded, I can my I have been sending you the screenshot. My mm -hmm. win rate mm -hmm. have skyrocketed. Yeah, skyrocketed. I can say that. <laughs> so skill stock is definitely a, the the place to be. With no doubt, I can say that. Uh, and they they have to yeah they have to enroll as soon as possible. Yes. Instead of wasting money depositing in the in the platform and they lose all the money it's better to invest in, in yourself first and finding a good mentor like you actually mm -hmm. mentors like you are very few they are very few you pay some people and they don't deliver as you as you did as mm -hmm. for me i i came to understand kind of after kind of week after week you know and mm -hmm. the market mm -hmm. yeah i can say that you are a good teacher. 
most people say yeah. like it's a very expensive session it's 3 weeks of no, session no, no, it's very expensive no no no, no, no. it is not expensive maybe no. for those who say it is expensive maybe they are not mm-hmm. maybe they want the rich quick or they want something which is okay if they are not able to pay for what is for what they are they are going to get in this kind of education you know mm-hmm. if you if you understand the kind of potential in mm-hmm. uh, that which in the market mm-hmm. with the right decision what mm-hmm. you are going to pay you can recover it in few months or in few weeks you know mm-hmm. so for me i say it is not about what i pay it is mm. the person that i become learning your concept mm. yeah yeah all right well thank you so much